When you first set up your view board, there are some things that you need to go through to make sure it's ready to roll. First, you'll need to select your language. Then it's gonna ask you about your network settings. We recommend just leaving it on DHCP. You'll see here that you'll be asked about your date and time. This is an important part because you're gonna to wanna to make sure you select the correct time zone. A lot of times we get complaints that the clock is not right on the board. 99% of the time, it's because the time zone was not selected properly. So come here and select it, scroll down to select your time zone, and we recommend using the network provided time. Next is your mode. So there are actually three different modes. Normal mode, which means the view board's just gonna run uh, the way it is with the whiteboard tool and browser and all the casting apps. You have what's called secured mode. What secured mode does is it basically disables all the casting tools, right? So uh, there's essentially no internet to the board. And then disabled is where the Viewboard OS is completely turned off. We don't recommend choosing that option unless you have an attached device like a built-in PC or a Chromebox that's gonna be the main computer for the board. We're just gonna leave it on normal mode for now. Hit next. Then you're gonna be asked about Energy Star. So the boards come default with Energy Star enabled. What this means is that after one hour of no physical touch input, the board will turn off. If this is something where uh, teachers are watching a video or a movie, remember a movie is not active touch input. So after one hour, the board will turn off even if you're playing a movie. So if that's something you're concerned about, go ahead and disable that you'll get a, a notification to confirm and then press next and then finally accept the terms next and now your view board is completely set up and ready to go.